Would you like to know how to upload a thumbnail on YouTube for live streaming? And if so, then this video is for you. Stay tuned. Hey, I'm Dale. I'm Walt. And this is Live Streaming Tech, where you're gonna learn how to live stream online, super simple. Today, we're gonna be talking about my favorite avenues, YouTube Live. That's right. Uh, so Dale, we had somebody hit us up in the comments, and actually I think he's probably been the second or maybe even third person that's uh, ran into this issue. And it's not necessarily uploading the thumbnail for a YouTube video, but how to upload a thumbnail for your YouTube Live video. And there's three different ways we can go about this, and I've, here pretty soon one of those ways is gonna disappear. There's through the classic mode, so when you're using YouTube Classic, you can be able to go through that way. That's probably one of my more preferred methods that I do. There's mobile. Now there's been some misunderstandings on how you get all that done. And then of course, last but not least, there is the studio version, which is gonna be the third version. We're gonna go ahead and set it. So without any further ado, let's go on over. Okay, go click Creator Studio Classic. Now this is gonna disappear here pretty soon, but I'll show you another way in later on. Okay, you're gonna select Live Streaming and then it should be into the Stream Now feature. This is where we're gonna to wanna to be. Now you can see I've never used this option here on this specific channel, but we can scroll on down, obviously put in all your metadata. I don't think we need to talk about how to do that, but you wanna make sure you're filling all this stuff out because as soon as you put that thumbnail in there, it's gonna put this on your static landing page. So we'll fill out our description and let's hit and change thumbnail. You're gonna select what you need right there. I prefer dimensions of 1280 by 720. It's perfect for this instance. It takes a minute. As soon as it's updated, it'll show right there. So really that's how simple it is through classic mode. Let's take a look at mobile. Now you're gonna have the mobile app of course for YouTube. You're gonna go ahead and click on that. It'll open on up. You're gonna click the little camera at the very top and select live. And of course, like we did in the last one, put all your metadata in there. We're gonna go ahead and type it on in. It's pretty amazing. It looks like I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> narrating this, but I'm not. Um, I went ahead and switched it over to public and it's gonna be inside the next screen. So you wanna make sure you get all your advanced settings like allowing chat, enable monetization. So we're gonna go ahead and hit next. Now, smile, say cheese. We don't need to worry about this thumbnail. <laughs> All right, and we're gonna select that pencil in the right-hand corner and then select Upload Thumbnail. Now, you'll wanna make sure your thumbnail's, in, of course, in your mobile device ahead of time, so that way you yeah. can go ahead, click, and then hit Save, and then you're ready to go live. Okay, so let's go on over into Studio and select Create and hit Go Live. Now, as we mentioned in the other ones, put your metadata in there, however you wish to do it. Um, this is going to be the standard here pretty soon, so get used to doing this. Uh, I selected upload um, or to public. Now we're gonna go ahead and you can schedule for later if you want, but let's just go ahead, upload our custom thumbnail. I'm gonna go ahead and select the one that I want to. Here we go. And that's the one I want. Hit open. And really, we're ready to stream. We just hit create stream and you're pretty much ready to go live right, right. after this. Now, remember I told you there was a back door on this. Yeah. They're still kind of putting a little escape hatch in the bottom right hand corner. You'll see it says stream now. So this will take you over to classic oh, if you're feeling overwhelmed. Okay. Now, this is here for just right now. And of course, you're gonna go through all of the same steps that you went through before. Okay, now that you're ready to go ahead and live stream, have you set up your YouTube channel for live streaming? If not, you're gonna wanna make sure you check out this video right here. It's a full playlist and we will see you over there.